Hello, my name is Max and I'm a shoe buyer here at Gut Style and I will be presenting you with our selection uh, for this poll and uh, it will be divided into three segments, dress shoe, then our casual collection and social options as well. By dress, I mean you wearing a suit. By social, with this collection, you wearing a blazer. And with your casual collection, you're not wearing a suit and you're not wearing a blazer. You on the weekend and you're relaxing. Well, the next stop will be our social uh, selection. Back to the colors. Brown is still the most versatile and uh, I also will throw into a mix maybe a charcoal color. Uh, very good base will work with uh, pretty much anything you will put in terms of the clothing. One of um, my favorite styles is uh, Chelsea boot. Uh, very easy to put on, uh, no laces. Uh, a, lot of our, a lot of us are lazy and uh, don't like to fiddle around with those things. Uh, you can just uh, pull them on your feet and uh, walk out the door. Another great shoe uh, for social is um, blue suede shoe. Great with jeans. Uh, with some of the suiting you can actually put, uh, put it with, um, especially with the fall collections, you will see a lot of tweeds and a lot of uh, kind of like uh, heavier fabrics. So I think uh, suede goes really, really well with it. Also goes back uh, to the jeans. And uh, this is a charcoal version uh, of the suede, um, suede Oxford. One of the most versatile shoe is the uh, wingtip broke. I'm showing you one in brown, um, again, because brown is the most versatile color. There's a little bit of a pop of color on the laces and the sole. Um, I like the sole here just because it's a little bit thicker. So, and uh, if you don't want something plain like this, you can always go into a brogue style. Broguing means the preparation on the um, leather of the shoe. Uh, and sometimes it can be a wingtip as well. And I actually like the combination when it's all together on the shoe. So let's look at the casual. Uh, first of all, I'm absolutely in love with this tan version of wingtip brogue boot. Um, First of all, they do look very, very clean, but what's my favorite about them is they wear really, really nicely, and more they will be worn in, uh, they will get just more character to it. Um, and uh, this pair uh, can be um, kind of like a cousin to this uh, dress black shoe. Don't be afraid to put it uh, with a nice lighter colored suit and wear it to uh, work on the Friday. The saddle shoe, uh, definitely great for the weekend. I see them with jeans, I see them with uh, uh, chinos as well, and um, just a little bit more character. So we all love the uh, moccasin style. Uh, this time around, I'm showing you a suede version in a blue with a pony hair on the top of the shoe. Uh, really, really cool, funky look, uh, different color and uh, definitely will be noticed. More rugged look and uh, all of the surplus uh, style lovers. Uh, I have this uh, boot from H by Hudson and uh, again pebble leather. Has an antique look and uh, uh, will work for weekend and uh, can be worn in a slushy weather. Okay, and also I would just wanted to point out that in the casual selection, I think that's the selection where, especially if you're kind of just building your wardrobe and have a limited selection at home, uh, casual shoes is probably the one that I would kind of go wild. And uh, it doesn't have to be expensive, but it should be maybe a little bit different. And that's why I wanted to show you that this pony uh, hair um, style in the moccasins or you can do a wild color on a sole uh, or uh, something really really uh, heritage and old school like a broke winter boot. 
I hope you liked the video and uh, as you see we have a great collection, don't be afraid, come into the store and uh, try them on, I'm sure we'll find something that you're looking for. You've upgraded your suit, get your footwear to the same level and hopefully I'll see you soon.